Hey, it's Tom Gallagher, the Videopreneur, and today we're looking at a 2022 Winnebago Solace 59PX. This is a Class B. It's offered by Van City RV in St. Louis, Missouri. Their contact information is listed below. Sticker price is $134.81. As we slide down the passenger side here, you can see the Winnebago badging. The wheels and tires are 16-inch wheels and tires. Let me give you some of the highlights. It has a Murphy plus a bed, wet bath, removable table, two screen doors, fiberglass pop-up top, exterior wash station, blind spot assist. It is a uh, Dodge Ram van. Here you can see the Solace badging on the side as well as the back, the trailer hitch, pre-wired, Van City, their phone number is right there, plus uh, the contact information's listed below. Here you can see the screens that uh, are pulled back as well as the fresh water station, plenty of cubbies and uh, drawers and cabinets. There's the Murphy bed. And I'll show you the more of the inside here in a, a moment. Sleeps four. I'll give you some of the uh, vitals on this. The length is 21 feet. Exterior width, six, eight. Exterior height, nine, five. Interior height is six, two. I'm 6'3 and moved around very nicely, move around nicely inside. The exterior is a bright silverish gray. And here we can see the power hookup. So we have a hitch weight of 3,500 pounds, gross weight 9,350. Here's some of the, uh, the tank capacity, fresh gray, uh, fresh is 21 gallons, gray water capacity 20 gallons. It is a 3.6 liter V6 gasoline engine Ram ProMaster, 280 horse, fuel capacity of 24 gallons. Here's your water fill up. We'll go ahead and pop the door here. You can see the Winnebago badging on the, on the driver's door as well. Very comfortable seating and uh, very well laid out ergonomically well laid out on the inside unfortunately the uh, sun kind of uh, washes things out when i'm trying to show you but i'll show you again from the inside when we get around there you can see the ram badging the ram grill as well as the uh, large, very large windshield allows you to see out very, uh, whether you're camping or driving, allows you to see out. So we'll go ahead and step up and step inside. Here you can see additional seating, the refrigerator. We have a, uh, the refrigerator is a single door compressor driven with a freezer. You can see your additional power ports, your toggles for your lights. Here we have some additional, uh, love the um, all weather flooring, very durable flooring. You can also have a portable table, removable table. There's a better shot of the dash. Again, that sun's coming in, so it makes it a little bit difficult with that large, large window. So it is a pop-up top. So it's a fiberglass pop up top with a uh, ex with a um, it air conditioning unit on the roof couldn't spit that out so cabinets galore here and they're all lockable safety latch I should say I shouldn't say they're lockable they don't have a, an actual lock on them but they do have a safety latch so you don't have to worry about a yard sale while you're driving down the the highway two burner cooktop the LP tank capacity is uh, just under 25 pounds. We have a water heater with a 2.6 gallon water, water heater. Here's your two burner cooktop with some additional information about the, the uh, vehicle on top. The drawers are extremely well made, very solid, all wood as well as the cabinets and deep cabinets, very well finished off, very high end on this unit. You can see your stainless steel sink with your gooseneck faucet. 
Electrical service is a 30 amp electrical service. More cabinets with plenty of storage underneath. So you have a single bed here you can see and then also a Murphy bed that folds down. So if you're just uh, driving by yourself, perhaps you're driving across the country, you can just uh, take a quick uh, fold that Murphy bed down and sprawl out. If you're traveling with a companion, there's plenty of room, plenty of cabinet space, as well as space underneath the Murphy bed. So if you have uh, duffel bags and storage bags, you can uh, throw those nicely here, plenty of room. And then also this under floor or part of the floor system uh, storage. Great place to store smaller items out of the way or securely store them. And again, that's the Murphy bed that folds down. As well as a dining table. There's your air conditioning unit. So you have heating and air conditioning. Plenty of cubbies with netting to prevent the yard sale or the gravity check. Blacked out uh, sun screens over your windows as well as uh, screens for ventilation, cross ventilation. So just a really a nice way to travel. And uh, we had opened the back door from the back and so that's the inside look. But again, it has a screen so you can put screen across the sliding door or the back door open the windows so you don't have to worry about it. the bugs coming in, but you'll have plenty of cross ventilation. Here is your bathroom, your commode, your shower. And it's a self-contained shower area as well as a, uh, a rod for hanging up your clothing. So it's not made really to, you know, your... Uh, volume of space is limited on this so it's not made to be real large so another commode test and truly there's plenty of room in here i if i had this i would take a sit down shower So you have a curtain rod that, uh, not a curtain rod, a shower curtain that goes across to uh, keep the water inside the bath shower. And there's plenty of room in there to take a sit down shower as I mentioned. Go ahead and give us a thumbs up, leave us a comment. Subscribe to the channel, we appreciate all the support. Share this with your friends, your neighbors, it makes a great stocking stuffer. Thanks again for watching. As we back away and take another three quarter look shot from the front of the van.